This is a Sting Greenlight trailer for Find Your Mum. It's basically Shower With Your Dad Simulator, but with all of the uh, uh, quirky wit taken out of it. Someone basically saw that game and thought they'd be the game that that game made you think it was, except genuinely. Let's have a look. There we go. That's a woman with a knickers down and a little black pixel in the middle there representing what one assumes is a the J J, and that was the entire trailer there. That's uh, that's all they felt you needed. About forty seconds. Yeah, yeah, I think forty seconds have given me a good idea as to how that game operates. Find your mum. You have to find your mum at the toilet. Early development footage over forty level. Yeah, well, don't sell us too hard on it, right? God, I can barely contain my excitement that the game has had so much effort put into it that we get 40 seconds of fucking game footage and two screenshots. And one of the screenshots is just level two. That's it. That's really all of the effort that's gone into this. Someone, uh, again, just to reiterate, someone saw Shower With Your Dad Simulator, thought that game kind of became this sort of quirky cult hit. Let's do that, but with everything that made that charming stripped out of it. And let's just have... Some women with their frou-frous hanging out for our enjoyment. Why not? I mean, you know, it's not as funny as dads. Dads are inherently funny. It's become a cultural touchstone. Uh, the idea of the dad as a comedy concept. Your mum's clunge, on the other hand, not quite as funny. I don't know why that is. That's just the, the, the zeitgeist of the day. You know, that's just what's become ingrained into our collective consciousness. Dad, funny, your mum's tuppence, not comedy material. Maybe that'll change one day, but something tells me that find your mum isn't going to change it. It's not going to change anything. At least not for the better. Well, that video was barely, barely anything. But then, it didn't give me much to go on, did it? One of those ones where it's like, you gotta, you gotta talk about it because fucking look at it. But... You get to the nitty gritty, you get to the bit where you're recording your words to speak, and you kind of you say it all within two minutes or thereabouts. And people are like, Well, why did I click on that? Why did I sit through, you know, potentially a commercial for that? And then you feel like you've let them down. I'm sorry if I've if I've let you down. 